Gang Do thoughts with Prince on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Remember, guys, to like, share, comment, and follow, and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our new uploads that you do upload here. Today is the 30th of our June at 2022. And so, guys, um, there's a picture which is uh, circulating on social media. The picture is of uh, Comrade uh, Chris Mchangwa and uh, my Monica Mchangwa. Is uh, I think uh, Dubai uh, for a holiday or maybe uh, for a visit we don't know but this picture is circulating on social media recently one of the pictures are attended in America and uh, we all know that uh, the NPF spokesperson Mam Changwa and our star in America and then was to finish my mess watch it imperialist Americans they are giving us sanctions and sometimes number of what you are you know when we are to put a very good news when you got a shower and bottom is in bubble but the next thing was on a lot of New York and it is out with Chicago I told my picture and so um hope you all did comment on this picture and they say that uh, if you are involved in a car accident in Kariba today you need an x-ray you will not get one because there is no x-ray machine at Kariba hospital it costs the same price of these two plane tickets to buy an x-ray machine there are no gloves for nurses to use at Parinatwa hospital there are no painkillers for women giving birth at Mbuyane um, and Martinetti hospital we wish our our information minister and her husband who is an NPF spokesperson a safe flight my supporter Musanga Nakuzup which is a uh, hundred percent true and we remember that accident against uh, Muswe independence in Kariba when we transfer from Kariba to Chinoy and uh, for treatment because Kariba hospital in case now I'm going to have my bandage and uh, so I went in the comment section of course to find out what I'm regarding to this picture which is circulating on social media someone is saying that uh, is suiting get the chungons go and march against sanctions and uh, well, I actually feel that at this time things will change. They continue to flaunt their ill-gotten gains in the eyes of the hungry and the weary due to the looting. Any same person will fight for a better Zimbabwe. The only fight is in the ballot box and then protect our vote. Many of us will be sleeping at the polling station. No more games. Social media has made it very hard for them uh, to play their games. Zim is on the brink of change. Hashtag register to vote Zimbabwe and um, nepotism and corrupt rule right here is the worst fault for building such luxuries. It's a trap that our leaders can't help but get caught in just like the SUVs and Lambos. And Margotim, the supporter, Musangana Kuzupo, Zeshua, Vanele Zano, Makaroi, Wanebenz. Margotim, I hate to say this, guys, but you would have been far better off under British rule than this. And I'm going to tell you, British rule, you have Ian Smith, yeah, before here, Tarati. Some people, they still insist that Ian Smith was better than the current regime here po and ya wa muna ngagwa inya ya wito titaka mtu anezo ya pano ina wana jinji on this channel maka vumira na azuma kati ya smita nga ato di nani than ED and ya so someone is saying that um so as to so as it stands right now there are groups of Zimbabweans mobilizing to go and support the Helen Assuzman Foundation in court against uh home affairs minister regarding the Zimbabwe exemption permits and uh, so someone else is, is talking about now you could change the social media right now in south africa of uh, zimbabweans who are fighting uh, to get my permits in south africa to harambe or south africa and uh, at a time whereby to allow to anywhere our concept of zimbabwe wow yeah because we just have to vote our vote next year so that things can change because uh, we can't continue complaining on social media and say could you hear this say that the ballot box is the only way we can make things change but uh one one they still insist that they want to stay and remain uh, in south africa that's why they are supporting um ellen Suzman foundation someone is saying that uh, living a lavish life while the majority of zimbabweans are picking crumbs under the table and school children being fed with salsa and hot salted water this is a shame and a disgrace uh, to the NPF for promoting corruption and looting of country's wealth. And uh, yes, Mgaruguti, uh, this is what Mchanga was fighting Mugabe for. He fought Mugabe, Grace and G40 so that he could be this extravagant. The war vets he used 
are still wallowing in poverty and yes my comrades vamwe vakaurana nawo hondo and vakutoshana mare kuti tivatenge muriwo wekujana asimanero but uh, you know their fellow comrade is flying to dubai and pakaipa someone is saying that the men used to be spot on during the time of Mugabe he was so against corruption and now he's part of it what happened i think it's because Mugabe didn't recruit him to be part of his dogs and now that he is a new master he has never ill spoken uh, the ZNP of course is getting the benefit he was debating with me the other day anga akuda kuchema yanga yango ambassador oh watch the video he can do anything to protect his master's dark rule and uh, yes he's talking about naiva chris mchango during mugabe time the man was known for being uh, against him that's why he was kicked out uh, from the government at that time because he was against uh, Mugabe. Uh, so uh, this is our order of thoughts with Prince on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Remember guys to like, share, comment and follow. People are discussing uh, a lot about the picture of uh, Amen Monica Mchangwa who is the information uh, minister and also uh, as an uh, spokesperson uh, comrade Christopher Mchangwa. Someone saying who dines at Arakashi have never been at the airport they were, their woman dying at the maternity was busy kurakasha featureless human beings and uh, someone said that if the npf wins um like 2023 and over that teaser takano koru wa next year kuti uh zanwe kango wina chete next year i want to be like a big rang ndoro wa pasi and uh, mwakati said part is that most Zimbabweans are okay with traveling on those dilapidated zopko buses as long as they have access to their pastors for prayers they don't mind that hospitals are in an appalling state and it's only in zimbabwe where looting politicians flash their lifestyles and people keep quiet and so this is the order of those prince on prince minute semi tv cut it out in the comment section remember to like share comment and follow this is not the first time that um Wam Changwa na Mam Changwa trend on social media. A few weeks ago they trended because Wangwa to New York and uh, yes, my pictures were posted on social media. People are now saying to go one hour in there. And but it's not getting Maria and yes, it's not getting Maria, that's their own private life. But people always feel like okay you guys nenge mushiti zoni ma sanctions this ma sanctions that but i don't know what i could and it's also digital that i'm gonna push got three meals a day some of the comrades my wife is i'm talking about it but their fellow comrade is flying overseas their fellow comrade are going to go to new york and it is a snake to article and most of the comrades also shows all the nice man in rubi k because a partner and marriage and i'm really and it's so this is the order of those prints on prints millage semi tv remember guys to like share comment and follow and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our new uploads that we do upload here on this channel and you got this but it's all in the comment section remember no vulgar words let's discuss order of those prints on prints miller entertainment tv blaze up